The software-based approach to industrial motion control and machine vision is now recognized as superior by every metric. Easier to integrate and maintain, easier to scale, and less expensive. Among software-based systems, EtherCAT has become the leading field bus standard because it allows users the flexibility of open hardware and software choices. However, EtherCAT solutions are known to have one significant drawback – complicated configurations. To set up or change an EtherCAT network, the master has to know the location and detailed variables of each specific device, which vary by device type and manufacturer. This information must be detailed in a custom-made ESI file for every device on the network, which is error-prone and time-consuming to research and document. Kingstar solves this challenge with its unique auto-configuration, which can automatically discover and configure drives from the most popular manufacturers, thanks to its built-in universal configuration library, which holds the details of virtually all known devices and is updated regularly, making it future-proof. Best of all, thanks to its simplicity, Anyone can make changes to the Kingstar system without having to rely on software maintenance engineers. Only Kingstar delivers it all. Instant configuration of all major motors and drives. Latest and greatest supported hardware. Configuration by on-site resources. No need to run and manage separate ENI.xml files. Open to all drives, with new drives added quickly and easily. The most complete, future-proof drive list available. Today we'll be demonstrating two of the most unique features of the Kingstar SoftMotion platform, Auto Discovery and Auto Configuration. We're working in a C-sharp application that is using the Kingstar API. I simply click Connect and it starts exploring the EtherCAT network to automatically discover what's out there. It looks at vendor IDs, product IDs, and all of the things that are already embedded in our software. No need to ever create another complicated eni.xml file. The results are already in. Here we see all details on everything that is on our network. Here is the Yaskawa drive, and we can enable that by just clicking here. And here we see Copley amplifiers, with no physical motors associated with them. Next, let's demonstrate how easy it is to configure and add more equipment to an existing network. We simply hit Disconnect. And let's say we have another sub-assembly with an XY Theta. All we have to do is hook in one simple CAT5 cable and then simply hit Connect. And Kingstar does the rest. It's now going out and automatically rediscovering what's out there, looking at vendor and product IDs, doing the DC synchronization, establishing timing between them, everything. It's going to show us three more drives. And here they are. There's our original Yaskawa. We can click Enable and Start, and right now that motor is spinning at 60 RPM. These are physical ELMOs. If we click Enable and Start, now they are off and running as well. So all you need to know from the point of view of the software is, this was 0, 1, and 2. And your new machine sub-assembly, the XY Theta, are right here at 3, 4, and 5. It's that simple. You've just seen a demonstration of auto-discover and auto-configuration using Kingstar the world's most advanced industrial motion control and machine vision software platform.